Hold it. Hmm. Mm, just get out of here. <laughs> No, there's only one place I need to go and play this. Okay, let's see here. Reward. Oh, yes. Yes. Um, perhaps the amber ore as a reward? Yes. Our treasure. Our most beloved possession. Guard. We must guard, but we must reward. The amber ore. Yes. We will get the reward. amazing ah oh, shucks well to be completely honest I kind of cheated never mind that you broke their hold over the amber orb after all these years it's it's unbelievable well I couldn't have done it without your help Hans if there's anything I can do for you something to help your spirit rest it's it's strange, but I feel like... like you're already helping me. No. No, not me. It's actually an old friend. Oh, is that so? Well, that's good then, I think. It is. I feel... at peace now. The reason I came here to this lake. It's so long ago, though. I just remember her reaching to me. She's so sad. It was me. I I made her sad. Oh, Anna, it was a mistake. Such a terrible mistake. I. I should never have come here. Hans. But what you're doing, I can't explain it, but it's helping my friend. I know it is. Then let's get this spell done. For Grandpa, and for her. Thank you. For everything, Anna. Thank you. Goodbye, Hans. I hope you're at peace now, wherever you are. Sir! Uh... Oh dear. Have you or have you not seen either of these two? Um... No... No. I have seen no such, um... Deviants? Deviants indeed, sir. Of the highest order. Well, second highest. Who, <clears throat> uh, might a gentleman who's not at all involved uh, inquire as to what they have done? I cannot say, good citizen, but the order comes direct from the queen herself. Well, queen to be. Bob, what have I told you about this? 
Once again, we're in the middle of an interrogation, and yet it's all about Bob, isn't it? Well, yes, you're right. It's not always about Bob. I'm sorry, sir. <sighs> it's quite all right, Bob. It's been a hard run today. But say we put our tensions aside and sample some of this fine establishment's offerings. What say you, good citizen? You will join us, won't you? Oh, uh, but sirs, I I'm not allowed to go in there. Nonsense! A man with a fine mustache is yours? Ha! <laughs> what pish posh! Come along now, it's in order! Eh. Uh... And just like that, the Weissefrauen went down and brought the orb up to me personally. Thrilling. You have the orb anyway, that's all that matters. Well, yes, but... You know that's quite a story, isn't it? Yes, nothing beats a child prattling on while people lay cursed and waiting. Oh, yes. Yes, I'm sorry. That is but one item, child. Don't get too excited. There's still a ways to go. I best get looking for these objects, then. Um, yes. Okay. I'll see you soon, then. With the objects. Okay then. Oh, hi, Ben. I didn't know. Oh. And then, the cowering thief turned and said, Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Uh, no. No, he said neither of those things. Whose story is this, anyhow? Hold on. Hold on. You two know each other? Hi, Anne. Uh, an innocent friend of mine, who isn't Anna the Wanted Girl. Ah, y yes Hello, mister. Who is a normal friend of mine and not a bear. You know, there is a young girl wanted in the area that looks just like you. Oh, like m me? B but I'm just a completely innocent girl. <laughs> An innocent, not guilty girl, you say? Say, you haven't seen a girl that actually is guilty then, have you? We can't find the lass anywhere. About the same age, has a bear fellow for a friend. Quite hard to miss, I'd imagine. Oh. Yes, yes, I'd imagine so, too. No, definitely no bear friends. <laughs> a friend for a bear. How strange. Strange indeed, but dangerous, so don't approach them if you do see them, you hear? Now, where was I? Ah, uh, darn it, I don't remember. Hmm. Are you okay, B... Uh... Yes, be um uh, be yarn, be yarn. Yarn is what my name is, isn't it? Uh, Abba, er, uh, Abber, Abby. Yes, yes, Abby. I am well, Abby. Good grief! You travelers have peculiar conversations. Do you always quibble over your own names? Oh yes. Nothing like a good name quibbling. Here, here, to quibbling. I can't turn down a toast. To quibbling! But yes, yes, I'm fine, thanks. Just hurry. We should get going as soon as possible, I think. Couldn't agree more. I'm figuring this out as quick as I can, I promise. If I manage to get this tied to part of the mechanism, then maybe, maybe I could have a pulley system. Use the clothesline to pull open the trap door. And if I run the other end upstairs, I can use it as a lever from there. All right, now let's see. Maybe if I try using telekinemius to get the rope tied up there. Tum 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 ta tum tum tum. <laughs> Little boy stew, little boy stew, only made better with a girl in there too. A town who dares to say I'm wrong won't have their children very long. 
Yes, perfect. Done. Now really, that's pretty impressive if I do say so myself. Now the trap is set. I can easily open the trap door upstairs by pulling on the rope. Yes? Oh, you! I'm sorry, I was... Uh... Are you hungry? You... Take a seat. Sit! Hopefully this time it won't jam and lose my dinner, stupid trapdoor, stupid... Stop. Yes, stupid child. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> nice and, and comfy and delicious. Gotcha. Isn't it opening? You're never getting out. Oh, but... 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 I'm not wicked. I clearly heard you say you would eat us. You sang about it, actually. Let me out! Let me out! Let me out! <sighs> Talking to this one is going to be tricky. What spell did you put on the book? <laughs> like I'll tell you, you wretched thing. You'll never have my book. Never. Kick it! Hmm. I'm going to regret this, I think. But what if we make a deal? Hmm? I'll promise to let you out if you promise to let me have the book back and... Hmm? And promise to stop kidnapping children. Hmm? No. My book! Not talking to you anymore. Go away! But... but you'll starve in there if I don't help you out. La 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 la, not listening! Why do you have to kidnap all these kids anyway? They never did anything to you. They get hungry. Not my fault they come nosing around where they shouldn't be. Well, it is your fault if you trap them and, uh eat them. Uh, uh, no comment. Next question. I'm on your side, you know. I get it. I hate children, too. Eh? Truly. They are the worst. So annoying, right? If I had my way, I wouldn't be a child anymore. I can't wait to be an adult. Yes, well, you are a stinking rotten child, so deal with it. I just wish... I wish one day I'll grow up to be a great and intelligent witch like you. Ha! Like me? <laughs> That's impossible. You'll never be as great at being a witch as me. No one will. Huh. <sighs> You're right. No one could ever be as great a witch as you are. Exactly. See, you're finally getting it. For a dirty, rotten, good-for-nothing child, you're not completely stupid. If you keep at it, you could at least be a slightly not completely terrible witch. Maybe.
I've dabbled in protection spells a little bit. Do you think I could figure it out? <laughs> figure it out? You're starting to see how great I am. What do you think? No, it's true. I admit, you're just way too good a witch. There's no way I could hope to know such brilliant spells as yours. Right! Exactly right! I remember everything in my clever, clever brain. And no one knows except me. <laughs> Do you remember the spell you used to protect the book? I bet it was something way too clever for me. Oh, of course it was. Spellbook, spellbook, dost thou see? The best recipes for children are bound within thee. There's not a cookbook or... Hold on. Ah, wait! No, no, no! <laughs> ah, curses, curses, curses! Well, whatever. You didn't hear it all, so it's useless. So, ha! I'm never talking to you again, and you'll never hear the rest. So, joke's on you! Ah, stupid, rotten children. Think you're all so clever and stupid little... I'll eat you all. Show you. This could be enough. I'll see if the sorceress knows the spell from just this bit. 